Hi guys, welcome back in this new episode of Detailing Guru. In this one, I'm going to show you how to prepare your car for sale and maybe with some tips and tricks, you can gain some extra bucks. Remember, you don't get a second chance to make the first impression. That's why obvious details are so important for your potential buyer to get a good impression. We need to go through a proper wash and a decontamination. We made many videos about it yet, so let's get into it. So the car now is washed and decontaminated and now we are going into these obvious details which are pretty important. First of all we're going to dress up the tires, make sure the exhaust is pretty shiny, check out our door shuts and for the final touch we will look into the engine bay if it's pretty clean and dressed up. In this episode, we're not going to talk about technical details. However, when it comes to an engine bay, some customers might be suspicious when the engine is overly cleaned. In this case, a proper clean of door shuts and tops will never harm. We made a bigger video and a deeper cleaning of how to do your engine bay, and you can find it out here. Now that we are done with the wash and the obvious details, for the rest, we are going back into the studio. Back in the studio and there are a couple of things we still need to do. First, we're gonna do a thorough clean of the interior. We made a great video about that, you can check it out here. But I can give you another tip when doing your interior, check the glove box because it may contain some personal information that you don't want to share with your potential buyer. So let's dive into it.
After cleaning the steering wheel, I noticed that you have a plastic part on this steering wheel that has issues with soft touch. It's pretty known with BMWs and in this case, it's far easier to buy a new part and replace the old one for a fresh look for your potential buyer. Non-OEM or badly installed window tint for me is a no-go and it definitely needs removal. So we are done with the interior. It's not an in-depth detail, but it's really good, really clean, and it will be very nice for your potential buyer. Another tip I can give you is when you would have some smells in your car, of course, not the smoking smells, but there are different types of smells. Take a bit of coffee beans, leave the beans for 24 hours under the seat of your car, and it will neutralize any possible smells. Okay, we are done with the interior. Next up is the exterior. Not everybody is into paint correction, but a layer of wax, whether it's by machine or by hand, can do wonders. We are done with the car and while it's clean and shiny, it's the perfect timing to make some cool and interesting pictures if you want to sell your car online. I hope this episode will help you in the future and remember, drive safe, when in doubt, flat out. Ciao!